Lovely, three games. Hayes, Bracknell, Weston. Losing all three, but it, tonight again, it didn't tell the story of what was a great performance from the team. I think that the, the biggest frustration in all this is, you know, when they've celebrated at the end and you, and you hear them kind of say, how are they down there? And, and that is the biggest frustration of it all. Um, they are relentless, they are big and strong, they are direct and they're very, very good in what they do. And I thought we stood up to them brilliantly uh, and the best we can. You've seen what they've done to teams this season, you've seen the cup runs they've gone on this season, you've seen even first half against Ipswich what they've done. And I thought we stood up to them toe to toe and, and we really went to battle with them. It's been a nightmare journey getting here, you know, even myself arriving at sort of 10 to 7 was hard for the boys. And I couldn't be prouder. You know, what more can I ask? They give me everything. They give the football club everything. But we sit here again tonight with no points. And I think on on territory, yeah, you'd say they deserve it. I think on character and desire, because they're like that every week. That we've had to go there tonight and dig as deep as what we've done. I thought we deserved the point. And and listen, they'll, they'll say otherwise. And I agree with what they're saying. I do because they are. They're relentless. They are very good at what they do. They're going to go close because of the way they play. They're going to cause teams problems all year. But to sit here tonight, that is another really hard one to take. But you know what? I have to take so many positives from the performance again. It's um, it's moving forward in the right direction. You've seen the boys, what, what they're giving us. I thought uh, Tom coming tonight had a lovely little debut for the kid. He's a young boy going thrown into that tonight. was relentless. Leo Donnellan come on and I think he set up the, the, the second goal. But the, what we've got done on is, is we've got excited. We've got excited looking like we're going to break away in the last minute and, and they've broke back on us and we've lost our shape. And, and I just said to him there, take the point, take the point, walk away and go home. And uh, we've not done that and that's uh, that, that hurt. But yeah, it's, uh, it's frustrating. And what must have pleased you is coming back twice against a team like Bracknell, the resilience shown and digging in when we needed to dig in. But to have that steal to come back and score close to the end, and that's what makes it even harder to take, I suppose. Yeah, it does. And, and look, we haven't created loads. I don't think Bracknell will allow you to create loads because they're territory side. They work in your half. They, they listen. I, I, you laugh, and, and I actually love it what they do. You know, they celebrate throw-ons, and, and that's great. You, you know, it's a, it's a trait they've got. I used to play against their manager, who's horrible little sod. Um, we used to have good battles, and, and their centre half has got the throw, and and it works for them, and, and it's brilliant. You know, I whatever works for each team, and fair play to them. Um, but we 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 you know, one nil down, and it was hard. It was a slog. It was it balls coming in the box, and then Riddell's a moment of magic. Great great finish. Come out second half. Look, my, my biggest frustration is from kick off. You know, we've lost LP in the warm up, which is a massive loss to us tonight. We needed him tonight because of the, the aerial threat that they had, and um, you know they've played a ball over Simeon's head. For me, it's a two-handed push. The referee said, "Yeah, he's pushed you in the back with two hands, but if I give that, I'm giving everything all night." Well, that doesn't really make sense. If it's a two-handed push in the back, it's a foul. They've, from the throw on, they've scored 10, 15 seconds into the second half. We've weathered again. We've weathered the storm. We've scored a great goal. Um, I think with David the you again, and um, but you know I thought I thought Dan had a very good debut tonight as well. He come in, he showed character. He shows he what he's up for the fight. That's again enough for me. Great travelling support. I'm just sitting here tonight again, disappointed, gutted, but very positive. The, the performances are outstanding at the moment, and, and I'm actually looking forward to when we play absolutely awful and win one nil because I've not had. I don't want to sit here and say luck or I don't know. I don't know. It, this is hard to take because it doesn't seem nothing seems to fall in our favour at the moment, and it looks like we looks like we're a very poor side. And I think you've seen it, the crowd have seen it. We're in a poor side, but we've got to start turning these performances into results because yeah, it's getting tight, you know. But we're still one win away, no damage. Same place as we was on Saturday, same place we was last Tuesday. Come off the back of Hayes, Western, and um, Bracknell tonight. I think we've had Chesham in there as well. So we've had a we've had a hard run, going into another very hard game on Saturday and Tuesday. They keep coming thick and fast. But um, from what I've seen tonight, if we can keep performing like that, keep to them levels, we will win games of football.